What's going on guys, it's Justin here coming at you from UMI Motorsports Park out here in Pennsylvania. And we're here for one thing and one thing alone, and that's Autocross Week presented by Summit Racing. Now the way this works is we're going to three different tracks over four different days. We're starting here at UMI, heading over to Race Pit tomorrow, and then to Dragway 42 in West Salem the day after that, and then back here to UMI. So the way the format is, is they take your best two runs of the day and they average those out. So it'll be eight runs total throughout the week and that'll give you your average time. We're gonna talk to some drivers, watch some racing and see what goes on here. It's gonna be packed full of plenty of action and it's gonna be a really good week. So let's get to it. So if you look behind me, what the drivers are doing now is a track walk to check out the track and get familiar with it. You have to pace yourself. You got to think about tire strategy because you can't change your tires. You got to think about fuel. You still got to drive. Depending on when you leave this facility or other facilities, you may or may not be stuck in traffic, construction, breakages, but you're going to have the time of your life. Woo! Okay? That's what this is about. So we're just sitting here waiting for our autocross to kick off. We ran into our buddy here. I'm Kenny Edwards. I'm from New York, Long Island. It's about 350 miles to get here, but it's worth it. It's a 66 Mustang. The whole front half of the car and the doors are all carbon fiber, aluminum dart motor, small block Ford, makes about 575 horse. It's got a floater rear, TKO five speed transmission. I can drive this thing anywhere. It's gonna, it's a very drivable car down the highway, but once they drop the flag over here, it's a rodeo out on the track. <laughs> Uh, are both running the event separately. So basically my car's doing double duty yeah. that everybody else's car, because we're making as many laps for two people as we possibly can. I was here visiting and uh, we went up to Summit and he's at the counter and he looks down and all of a sudden he looks up and his eyes are like this big. I'm like, what? He goes, look, and he pulls up the flyer and I knew it was all done for. Not only is this event sponsored by Summit Racing, but we have some of Summit's very own even running it. I'm here with my buddy Alec, and he's running it here in his Ford Fiesta. This thing is super awesome, and we're gonna let him tell us a little bit about it. It's a 2012 Ford Fiesta. I uh, bought the car brand new when I was commuting back and forth to Summit. After the factory warranty ran out, decided to just go full track spec with it. Uh, so started gutting stuff on it, took the AC out, uh, took the back seats out roll bar, full suspension build. Dyna's about 115 to the wheels, adjustable coilovers, poly bushings. Uh, I'm excited to see what you do this week. Can't wait. Awesome, appreciate it. So how is autocrossing this thing today versus like running it on a road course? <laughs> Exponentially different. Um, it's not really set up for this tight stuff. It's a big car. I mean, it's 4,000 pounds. <laughs> um, so it just, isn't really it, it's a blast it, it's just not gonna be super fast I'm sure the 150,000 miles is really helping it out too it's just broken yeah, man absolutely. it's like a watch absolutely. so it looks like that's gonna be the end of the day for us it looks like the rain's gonna cut this short a lot of the guys are rolling out so after day one, and first we have Aaron Shu with the Mitsubishi Eclipse. In second, we have Justin Peachy with the Corvette. And in third, we have Jeremiah Thomas with the Mini Cooper. A great first day of racing. You know, we saw a lot of cool cars today and we can't wait to see what the rest of the week brings us. Said the guys are on their way to Pitt for tomorrow and then on to Dragway 42 and then back here to UMI for the final day. So we'll catch up with you guys later this week and see how we're doing.
track and the racing has, have been awesome. Today at, at uh, Dragway 42, we were at Pit Race, we're at UMI. Those are three really premier autocross sites and it's been really cool to be able to see those back to back and, and, and experience some different courses. My name's Sam Johnson. I'm from the UK originally, but I live up in London, Ontario, Canada. This is far from a stock 72 Camaro. Um, it's got an LS-based engine, an LQ4, uh, board and stroke, so it's a 408 stroker kit. It's a Summit Racing stroker kit, actually. We've got a fairly unique 8 into one header system here, so these are all equal length. Gives the car a really unique sound. Uh, sounds more like an exotic V8 high revving than a, an LS. I'm a big fan of the drag and drive events, so we did drag week in this car in 2019. Uh, and I love the combination of meeting all the racers here, uh, making new friends as well as kind of beating on your car. And the road trips are just as much fun and chatting with the guys at the hotel at night. It's the whole experience really, there's nothing else quite like it, it's a ton of fun. I'm just catching on every day right when we're done. That's right where I feel like I'm starting to get faster. My first time at Dragway 42 is a very big, big autocross course. I'm learning how to, you know, match my res back down to second, um, get the truck under control. Leave the track now ahead we'll to the retail store. Fun time out at uh, Raceway 42. The track was fast. We're doing great, having a blast. Awesome. Big thanks to Summit. It's like the whole entire catalog on display. I think my two quickest times are enough to put me back in the lead by a little bit, but uh, Justin Peachy and the vet here and I are back and forth every day, so it's been pretty fun so far. We got one more event to see who ends up on top. We're back out here at UMI Motorsports Park for the fourth and final day of Autocross Week. They set up the course a lot different than last week, and by the end of the day today, we'll know who our champion is. These guys put in six, 800 miles on their street cars, but they're also proving them on track. So Justin Peachy and Aaron Chu, I saw on social media last night, after three events, I believe they're within 0.046 seconds. I've had kids, young kids ask me, oh, you know what they say, my car doesn't have enough power. It doesn't uh, have big enough tires. It doesn't matter what you have. If you, as long as it's safe, if you run anything you have to its limit, you're gonna have fun. Actually very surprised to come through with very minor um, issues with the car, it survived pretty well. The biggest thing for the week was just the battle with Peachy. We're two different classes, he's unlimited, I'm unboosted, but it was him and I all week back and forth for overall win. So that's it for our time here at Summit Autocross Week. We had so much fun, four days of awesome racing, great stuff going on, awesome announcing, you can't beat it. Like the this is absolutely ever. fantastic. Best summit store ever in Akron. Yeah, you can't beat it, you know, and not just in Akron, we have four of them. 
So until next time, make sure to like and subscribe to that Summit Racing YouTube channel for all your car content from tool reviews, vehicle builds, celebrity stuff, and so much more. I'm Justin with Summit Racing, and I'll see you later.